friend. So when I see these people having all these great debates about how these people are living their lives, not knowing that it is completely political, transactional, transactional, and negotiable, like it's, it's all a ruse, a ruse in the respect that since the dawn of time, marriages have been arranged. And we think somehow we think all the things that have been happening since history have stopped. We think slavery has stopped. We think nepotism, not nepotism, that just popped in my head. But we think people marrying for status has stopped. Just because they gave it a nasty name, they tricked y'all into thinking marrying for wealth is a bad thing. (laughs) I once heard only poor people marry for love. And now that I'm coming into more of a space of awareness, because first we're going to being offended is part of the trap, right? Because we automatically close our minds off to the information. So we're offended. Oh my God, only poor people marry for love. Nobody's going to tell me I didn't marry for love, even though we know we didn't marry for love. I marry for love. That's why I'm fighting for it. But we didn't marry for love. We married for whatever it is that we married for. Some of us married to get a daddy for our kids. Some of us married to get a mama for our kids. Some of us married for money. Some of us married for... We get married for all these different reasons. And so when we look at somebody else who got married for a different reason than we did, we judge them. That's silly. Judgment is silly. But when we sit in here and just be having all these debates about what other people are doing with their lives instead of taking that time to focus on what we're doing with their own lives. And then rip, rip, rip. These fuckers only married for optics. Like, y'all really having your perspective debates over their perspective decisions. Like, it's wild to me. Ooh, you got the bomb. Mm, you got the bomb ass. I'm gonna go listen to the dog pound now. Ain't it funny how this JT Glorilla little came up perfectly at the right time to get the focus off of Miss Miami? I think it's Miss Miami. I know y'all fans get mad at me for messing up names. I am not messing up names out of disrespect. I'm just this adjacent to pop culture. I'm adjacent enough to have topical topic talking points, but not so in-depth that I know every single fact backwards and forwards. And the fact that you know every single fact backwards and forwards about somebody else's life, but you don't know every single fact about yourself backwards and forwards, that's something you need to focus on. So stop getting mad at me for not knowing a name. Be mad at yourself that you're mad at me for not knowing a name. How you feel disrespected for someone you don't even know. But I sipped my tea and mine's my business. Shop my merch, tip the jar, coach the coach, read the books, buy the Amazon links, check out my website. Lifestyle.com. Get to know me if you're in the Phoenix area. Go and come down to one of my events. And if you want, fly my ass out and I'll host one for you too. Can you imagine this in real life? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I got an entourage. I got an entourage. They don't know it yet, but they are part of the whole the package. When this blows, this blows. So they better get ready. And are you ready? Oh, yeah. It's happening, y'all. Those of you who have been in it, it's happened. We did it! I love every single one of y'all. I love y'all from the first one to the, the, the most recent one. Somebody said, truth followed. I still get excited about that stuff. And let me remind myself so I will always get excited about earning your respect. Because those of you who are here now, I earned your follow. Even in the black girl follow train where most of y'all came from. Because just because we were following for follow, I didn't have any standards at that time. But I didn't have any standards at that time. So, you know, a thing's a thing. You know, but some of y'all had standards. The same filtration system that you apply for all aspects of your life, you're filtering through the black girl follow train. You know, but on the pro side, because I didn't filter, I met a lot of people I wouldn't have met otherwise because I put my standards in place so you understand how you gotta pick and choose the application of said standards i forgot my point but i appreciate every single one of y'all from the root to the tutor from the beginning to the end from the alpha to the omega what's another way to say the beginning to the end me
All of you. Start, finish, go. Um... From the... I got one. Like, give me from the end? We already did that one. From, from dusk to dawn. What's dusk to dawn? If I tell you, then I get another point. Oh, I, don't get re- I don't care if you tell me. Morning to night. Oh. Okay, you guys are Okay, um... Come on, because I got my next one. Use association. I said morning, night. What is something that happens in the morning and the night that you can say that means the same thing? Lunch and dinner. No, I mean breakfast and dinner. Boom. Okay. How are you, Kim? You got something, Kaden? Mm-hmm. What you got? Ben five didn't have a meal. Didn't make it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's still, no, that's still cool. But he gave me an idea. Sure, sure. That's good. Cool. Egg McMuffin or breakfast sandwich. Steak. Mm. Steak, potatoes, and broccoli. I have one. Um, eggs to bacon. Those are both breakfast meals, though. Mm. And I just said food, so you have to... Take that another way. How can you take the foods? Is vegetables the food? I got one. Wait, what, wait, wait. What, what time of the day do you usually eat vegetables, and what's the opposite of vegetables? You're on to something. Carrots and apples. Yes, because what is an apple? A fruit. And what is a carrot? A vegetable. When do you eat fruit? Mm, when we have fruit. In the day or the night? When we have fruit. Amen. In the day or the night? You typically. Mm-hmm. Any time I know. No, at day I I, I eat fruits at day. Yeah, because your answer depends on whether or not you get this point. So yeah, strategy, I'm homie, I'm honesty gonna... and strategy. And then when do you eat vegetables? Typically in the day or at night? And I'll be right back. It's just a simple I'm question. Gonna prove, I'm gonna prove, me. prove to me what? Because it's the night you're gonna eat some okay. some fruit. Mister Literal here. Welcome to my content, if y'all not familiar. It just goes where it goes. Those of you who like linear thinkers, she's not me. And it shouldn't be you either. Because if you're a linear thinker, you have trapped yourself into believing that you can only contemplate one thing at a time. Do you know how many problems I solve in a three-minute time span? Because my mind is like... Do you see how I'm training my kids? Association. Word association. What does this make you think of, make you think of, make you think of? Mental exercise. What are you doing? You're eating a carrot? Yes. The people must...